Hi guys, um, doing a little bit of a test flight here to see how the uh, Mavic Mini as camera would uh, perform at night. So I'm out here, there's me, you can barely see me, but uh, I am standing in the dark in between the two apartment buildings and it's very windy out so I'm trying uh, to see first off how stable this will be but uh, also how well it will um, work at night or in the evening uh, so uh, right now it's um, I, th I think it was about 5 30 in the evening that I did this and uh, it was getting dark already or fairly dark and uh, quite windy out so um, just climbed above the uh, apartment buildings there just to see and there we can see a, a view of downtown uh, here in Edmonton and that kind of gives you a, an idea of what it looks like and then I raised it up a little bit higher uh, and I noticed uh, the higher I, I would go the, uh, the stronger the wind was pushing up against the drone um, but it did keep it fairly stable and I did like that so yeah, the drone is doing what it was supposed to and um, that's excellent uh, so now I'm panning from the north over to the east a little bit there and uh, you can see a lot of lights of course we're you know uh, what we call central south side of the city so we can see quite a distance around it uh, we've got probably 10 miles of city in all directions if not more so um, it did show quite well um, although I probably could have raised it up a little bit higher and uh, something I I noticed that I'm doing too uh, too quickly is panning the uh, the drone around I should slow down with uh, doing that but anyway like I say I just wanted to try it and um, ulterior motive is is to do fireworks um, later on uh, in the season or when you know they get around to New Year's and stuff like that so give it a whirl anyway I did hit the um, the home button it did bring the drone back down uh, of course I was concerned about once it got lower than the uh, the apartment buildings because that wind would change and being right in between the two buildings it was kind of a um, pushing uh, pushing the drone around a little bit uh, so it's trying to land it over about four feet or five feet from where it took off and I actually wanted to get it back on I put that board down that I've got that's uh, 18 by 24 inches not a very large landing area or takeoff area but it suffices for what I'm doing so I manually took over the landing and uh, uh, flew little bird over there and uh, finally did manage to put it down uh, on the board so no grass uh, was killed in in this uh, flight <laughs> anyway um, that's it guys just figured I'd um, do that quick little uh, test to see how well it uh, would do at night and I think in a reasonably well lit area or even for nightscapes um, it should uh, should suffice and uh, should be able to uh, uh, take some uh, nice aerial uh, shots Anyway, take care for now. Thanks for watching guys, and we'll see you on the next video Bye for now